a regular figure. Is it a regular figure or a, use the chat box? Use the chat box. It's a regular or a irregular figure. Now I have a twister for you all. We have to find the area of this irregular figure. Right? How can we find out? If we have to find the area of any irregular figure, how can we find out? Uh, yes, Angad? Yes, sir. Sir, we have to count the number of full squares mm -hmm. and half and two half squares equal to one half square. And if any square is less than half, we have to ignore it. Mm -hmm. And if any square is more than half, we have to convert it as full square. We have to add all the squares and count it as one square meter. Very nice. Very Rashmi, you want to say something else? Sir, my name is Riddhi. Riddhi. Okay, Riddhi, I, in a yeah. day or two, I will remember your names and faces. Please cooperate till then. Yeah. Riddhi, you want to tell me? Yes, sir. So, I know why do we do that? Like, if it is more than a half, then we could consider it as one because if we combine all those um, smaller than halves, then we would get one or something like one. So, we could use it like more than half could be one and that's ten half we don't need to count again Rashmi, this method gives us an approximate area we get an estimation of area we do not get exact area and it is pretty close to the correct answer which we have so whenever we have to find the area of any irregular figure we draw it over a graph paper where the whole graph or area is divided into unit squares and then we count out and count out the number of squares as you told me let me suppose that the area of square which i have taken here is one square units right so we count number of full squares number of half squares and we find uh, if we try to count out the number of full square in this figure will be will be 32 and the number of half squares will be 21 so area of one square is one square unit. So area of 32 square will be 32 square units. And I have 21 half squares. So 21 into 0.5 will give me 10.5. So when I add all these up, 32 and 10.5, the area will come out to be approximately 42.5 square units. 